today, a midsummer update on the drought and how it's affecting our local ag industry. Also, how it could affect you and your family. And 23 ABC's Laura Acevedo is live at the Bakersfield Museum of Art, where that meeting will take place later today. Laura, paint that picture for us. Good morning, guys. During today's meeting, local farmers will have the chance to talk about how the drought is affecting them, and they say that it's, if it's affecting the farmers, it's also probably affecting you. Agriculture and oil are the lifeblood of this community and many others in the valley. In the middle of a severe drought, farmers and growers in Kern County are getting hit hard. The loss is, um, number one, there are quite a few acres that have been fallowed. They're just not being planted. There are some a lot of cases of especially citrus being pushed out because there's no water to it. That is why today the Kern County Farm Bureau and the Water Association of Kern County are teaming up to host a panel discussion for farmers and the community. Organizers say they want to educate the community about the changes they're making to the way they grow and water the food you eat. The San Joaquin Valley is the number one agriculture producing area in the country. You can't grow oranges in Montana and you can't grow table grapes in Nebraska and you can't grow almonds in Minnesota. So if you don't get your food from here, I always ask where are you going to get it? This event isn't for farmers only. The general public is invited to see the negative impact of the drought firsthand. But you should care because your job might depend upon it. Our community certainly depends on it and we feed the nation. Our farmers feed the nation. Our food goes everywhere. If you're interested in attending the meeting, it begins at 9 a.m. right here at the Museum of Art, located at 1930 R Street. There is a $10 fee to attend, and they will also be giving field tours where the farmers will show just how hard the drought has hit their crops. Guys, back to you.